Well, everybody, how are you guys doing? You staying safe? See if I can get this to look at me. Anyway, I don't know if there's anybody watching. Uh, anyway. Uh, is anybody going to come on? Where is everybody? Anyway, I didn't, I didn't call to show you my mask. I just wanted to tell you that uh, we're staying safe down here. And uh, I had to trim my beard so I could use a mask. Now, I'm not going to. I'm not going to worry about it because we're getting ready to head out of here. Hey, Chops. How you doing, buddy? We're uh, doing good down here. And do you know of any rides up in your area that are being canceled uh, or postponed? I haven't heard anything from Washington area. Let me know if you did. Uh, hey, Larry. Uh, I just got a message. I'll repeat, I'll say it now, and then I'll repeat it at the end of this thing. I don't want to be on here as long as it was last time. Uh, Pete R., a friend of mine on here uh, that watches the YouTube channel, he said that the Red River Rally in Red River, New Mexico, for uh, Memorial Weekend is canceled. Uh, that, surprised, that don't surprise me. I think anything that's going to be happening over Memorial Weekend is going to be canceled. I was glad to hear that. Uh, here we get some light. There we go. Uh, glad to hear that uh, Texas is opening up some state parks. Uh, Oklahoma's thinking about opening, and there's some other places too. Hey, Paul, Cliff. Uh, Getting ready to go on a ride? Yeah, I wish I was too. Cliff, you have a safe ride out there. Uh, okay, Chops just put something on here, asked him about the rallies that are being canceled. And uh, he, he was on one today. The road uh, damaged the tire. Oh, he hit some something on the road and it damaged his tire. We're now, they're now at the Harley Davidson dealership. So he's getting his, he ain't talking about a rally. He's talking about uh, he had a little uh, road mishap getting his uh, chops. His, you've seen chops. You guys know him. He rides, rode with me last year to Sturgis. Oh, I got some news here. Uh, you know Spanky. Anybody that follows me to Sturgis knows Spanky. Well, Spanky had an accident yesterday. He was in surgery for uh, two hours from what I understand. Putting his wrists back together. Well, you know, Spanky ain't no little boy. And I had to put a plate in there. I haven't talked to him. I've only talked to Willie. You've seen Willie on my uh, uh, deals. So, yeah, thanks, Jobs. Uh, Jobs sent him one of those. Uh, Willie called me and told me about it. It was too early. Uh, Spanky was out of probably cuckoo land with pain pills and such. Hey, Charlie. So uh, anyway, we're wishing him a speedy recovery. Uh, oh, on the ladder. <laughs> like I started to say, he fell off his ladder. Well, his ladder, he was only on the first rung of a three-foot ladder. But it folded or crashed. And from what Willie said, he landed on his arm and just shattered it. So everybody out there wish Charlie, I mean, wish... Uh, Spanky a speedy recovery. And uh, like I said, the Red River Rally in Mexico, New Mexico, is not happening. I don't see anybody saying anything about uh, hello back there in Olympia. Uh, I do have some announcements to say, uh, you know, I, I make a little money off this YouTube channel. If I make enough to fill up half my gas tank a month, is about where I am. Sometimes I'll make enough to fill the whole thing up or three quarters. But right now, for some reason, YouTube is not paying. And I know there's a lot of you guys watching because I can see there's 19 of you looking at me right now. And you're all, a lot of you are quarantined. I don't know why they're doing this, but they're doing it to all the YouTube uh, people. Uh, so uh, I'm going to be firing a bunch of good stuff over there on my Patreon channel if you guys care to do that. 
Yeah, you out of here, Chops? Oh, yeah, Chops talking about getting me some tires. He can drop ship tires. Uh, Chops Ahoy, uh, probably that's his uh, handle on uh, YouTube. He went with us to Sturges last year, like I said. And Charlie Blood, I talked to Charlie Blood about Sturges. And he called out there to Kathmandu, and he said, they're still going, uh, still planning on it. That's in August. Maybe it'll work. We also, uh, luckily, South Dakota, North Dakota, and I think Kansas and Nebraska never did shut up. They're, I mean, they're, they're being careful. They're doing their six-foot distancing stuff. That's what we're doing. We've been doing that forever. I, don't, I haven't shook a guy's hand in a long time. But uh, the thing about South Dakota is they got a big outbreak there in Sioux Falls. You guys know about that. Uh, so if you're going to go to South Dakota or through South Dakota or whatever, try to go around Sioux Falls. It was at one plant, but that one plant, you figure 480 people got it there. They have families. They go get gasoline. So be careful there. We'll, we'll, we'll keep looking at Sturgis because I know most of you out there, that's what you're interested in. And uh, uh, thanks, Paul. He said, uh, give me uh, kudos to old uh, Spanky. Uh, that's all about all I got to say is so far, the farther this goes, the more the rallies are going to be canceled. But they're start all, starting to open up the states. And we are still waiting for New Mexico to open up because that's the way we want to leave here. We're going to be out of here in just uh, about 11 days. Or so. I don't know. We're going to be out of here soon. Uh, and I'll be videoing everything that's open and shut and telling you guys what to do, what not to do, or advising. I don't care what you really do. It's just like masks. You know, I don't know how many of you guys are going to wear masks, but if I go onto a state and they say you got to have one, Plus, my neighbor made me a really cool one that's in my truck. I'll wear it. Now, if I go into a state that they want to register me and stick a needle in me and put a tracker in me, that ain't happening. You ain't putting a tracker in me. Uh, but I'll go along with a lot of things. I'll keep away from people. Uh, we're going to stay safe on the road. Uh, we won't come with, we'll keep our distance. We get fuel. I got enough fuel. Uh, I can go about a thousand miles, eight hundred to a thousand miles, depending on the uphill or not. But we'll be safe. Uh, bond free here in California is going to happen. Oh, born free. Yeah, I got. Not sure if born free here in California is going to happen. That's from Larry. Yeah. Uh, it is a builder's rally and had already brought bought my grass. I guess he had oh, grass passes, whatever that is. I guess that's so he can go in and see him, but they're not going to have that. Uh, so uh, that's another one that they're not, not for sure if they're going to have it. Born free in California, some rally for builders. Check that one off. Doesn't look like that's happening. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Spanky is uh, going to be riding the bike, not the ladders. He won't be riding his bike for a while. Hope, I haven't talked to him yet. I'm hoping he's going to be healed up enough to ride with me to Sturgis. Because uh, I still plan on going, if possible. I mean, if, if they got guards at their gates. I mean, even if they don't have the rallies, this uh, the Red River rally, how they canceled it is they canceled all the vendors. That doesn't mean the people ain't going to show up. Some of us would be camping out anyway. And and that's another thing I wanted to talk about. A guy brought this to my attention. If this gets bad again and we're out on the road, you might want to make sure you got everything you need on your bike to eat, to sleep, and to get to where you're going. Because there may not be nothing open nowhere. Uh, no motels, no nothing. We don't know what's going on. So be prepared. I'm going to take enough food to last me a couple of days on my bike. And uh, I always carry my tent, so that'll be okay. Uh, 
what else we want to talk about here? Uh, anybody said anything? Oh, I got the, I got some rides here. I'm going to put on here because uh, they're all they're Frankie put them together. He did he did a beautiful ride just down the road and he just filmed it. He filmed like hours of it, and you're going to like that. I I uh, put on two videos today and I'm this will go on today because I uh didn't realize i'd done that so uh uh oh cliff's too broke for sturges well they have a ride back home where i'm from and that's what they call it too broke for sturges get on your bike and go for a ride cliff it doesn't matter where you go uh come over and see me cliff in arizona but i won't be here long uh I'm I'm afraid a lot of people are going to be broke going to Sturgis. A lot of the people that ride bikes are hardworking people, and they aren't working. And if they don't have that money coming in by the time they get it coming in, they're going to be paying bills that they missed because they're going to take care of their family first. That's the way most bikers are. What do we got here from Paul? Oh, he's from the UK. He said everything here in the UK is closed. And no traffic apart from health workers, police, essential workers, food deliveries, and similar. Yeah, some places are bad. They ain't even letting you drive your bike just to go out and get some fresh air. They want you to stay in your house. Glad that's not uh, happening to me. I can't stay in my house. It's getting hot. It was 90 something yesterday. It's supposed to be in a week, it's supposed to be 97. If you've ever stayed in one of these trailers when it's hot, 97, you might as well be in a in a steel box because you're going to be burning. Hey Tim, how you doing? You like the shirt? Yeah, I guess where I got it. Uh so UK is locked down, can't even go for a motorcycle ride. So I guess we should feel blessed about that. We can go riding. The ones of us that has motorcycle. I'll be getting my motorcycle out. We're hoping to be back into Idaho in June. We got a wedding to go to up there. That's why we're headed back there. Uh, but I don't even know if the wedding is going to happen. They're canceling everything everywhere. Idaho is still, matter of fact, they're supposed to open up the end of this month. We'll know a lot in two weeks. This virus thing's supposed to go up, hit the plateau, and then go down, and then they open it up as long as they don't. Open it up, flip the light switch, and everybody comes out, coughs on everybody, and everybody's sick, and we're doing it again. It could last a long time if people don't take caution while they're out. So uh, Ohio Bike Week is postponed. That's from John. Uh, I won't even try to say his last name. I'll say it wrong. But anyway, John just said Ohio Bike Week is postponed. Uh, may reschedule for later in the year. Boy, by the end of this year, you're going to be able to go to rallies everywhere because everybody I've talked to that's postponed uh, is doing that. A lot. Some people are just canceling it because, man, if you, it's it's terrible for these guys, the ones that have to postpone it or the ones that have to cancel it even bad, worse. They got their t-shirts printed, they got their hats made, they got everything for that year. So. Here's what my think thought is on that. Why don't you help them people out and buy their shirts online? Buy their hats online because they're going to be rare because they didn't have the ride. So buy buy their stuff and help them out. Buy American. Uh, Arizona Bike Week, from Cliff just said, is postponed till October. Thanks, guys. Keep sending me, telling me what's going on. Uh, so far, Kentucky Bike Rally is still on in Sturgis, uh, Kentucky. Hey, why? That's Kentucky, ain't it? It's in July. So that should be okay. Oh, hey. Hi there, Misty. Misty? Misty? Misty. Misty from Coca-Cola. How you doing up there? Uh, you guys hear anything about Idaho rallies, Misty? Let me know. 
pull them up. Do a Google search for me and and let me know. Vicky Singer, sick, sick, sick. She ain't gonna. You ain't gonna see her on this one. I don't even know where Hank is. He might be out laying in the sun. I bet he's laying right behind the chair here, though. He don't get that far away. Uh, there we got Peter from Ireland. Yeah, how's things going in Ireland? Uh, let us know. Uh, we just heard about the UK, man. They're they're shut down. You can't even go for a motorcycle ride to refresh your air in your head. Uh, well, that's what's going on. I know you guys can't read these. So that's why I'm telling you about them. Okay, we got from Paul. Uh, Paul's a guy in England, I think. The word is going to affect the word it is. It's going to affect Europe for at least a year. Nobody even booking holidays. All events of all types canceled here and no word of rescheduling Ireland the same. Man, I feel sorry for you guys. Uh, I got to get out. Like I said, it's going to be too hot. We're going to get out of here and head. I'll show you. You stay with me. I'll. I'll uh, Throw stuff on here and tell you what's open, like I said, and closed and help you out. And if anybody sends me anything about a bike rally that's still going on, I'll put it on here. But it looks like more is being shut down than happening. And that's the way it is. But at least we're not over there in Europe. That's bad, guys. Sorry to hear that for you guys. Uh, let's see. Complete lockdown. This is Peter Pringo. Uh, I don't know where you're from, Peter. He didn't say. But complete lockdown, only allowed out for two miles round trip. Wow. Now, this is, this ain't fake news, guys. I'm telling you what I'm reading right here. And I have, these guys have no reason to be lying to me. Okay, we got something from Pocatello, Idaho. Uh, the POW MIA rally still on in July in Pocatello. So far, we're hoping July will get her, go get her done. Uh, Paul says they have, uh, uh, sorry, I got to tip my head to read. Paul says uh, we have uh, Corona 900 deaths in a day just in the hospital. We figure add 200 in. Uh, care homes. Damn, in a day, 1,100 people dead in a day. That's not good, guys. That's scary. You got to think about it. That's a lot of people. And think how many New York's using, losing six, 700 a day. All these communities were, it's just killing us. Uh, it, it's mind boggling when you think about these. These are people, this person has tons of friends and family that are grieving. It's it it's heartbreaking. I ain't gonna talk about it. I'll start crying. Uh, looks like uh, Ryan's V twin Boggs Boggs is holding out for Sturges, as we all are. God, I hope it don't get as bad as uh, over there in Europe. Man, that that's that's bad. The UK is similar to California to put. Put it in. Oh, the UK is smaller than California. To put it, put it in. It's smaller. UK is actually smaller than the size of California. And look how many deaths they're having. Ah, man, it's terrible. Hey, Marilyn, how you doing, Jack? Uh anything? Any any uh, rides you want to talk to me about in uh, Maryland? I didn't want this to go on too long, but man, that, that's it's mind boggling to me. I don't do good with with deaths and and people dying and stuff like that. It, uh, you know, we lost our son last year, uh, about 13 months ago now. And uh, I know how hard that was. I, I can't imagine. I mean, some of these people have not only lost their son, they've lost their husband or they've lost their wife lost their daughter they've lost a bunch of family members god that's just terrible okay 
Uh, let's see. Uh, Beartooth Rally in Red Lodge, Montana is still a go as far as now. Now, I've been to that. That's a great place. If you haven't been to Beartooth, uh, Beartooth Pass or Beartooth Road, Beartooth Pass, I think it is. That's, if you're in Idaho, if, if you're in America, go see that. And if you can't get to America to see it, check out my video because I put it on there. Nothing, uh, Jack R says, everything, everything is, is canceled. Where are you at? Where are you from, Jack R? He says, nothing, really, everything is canceled. That's him, Bill. Yep, Phil. Yeah. It's rough. Ah, uh, you that didn't know, I lost my uh, son last year. He, he lost he, drug overdose. Uh, he didn't want to go. He was, just did. And I got a video on here. I took his ashes to uh, Sturgis last year. You want to check that out? Uh, Southern Maryland. Okay, that's where Jack's from, and he said everything's canceled there. Hey, Frosty. Yeah, you always make me feel good. Nobody can see you, but Mount Lines, thank you very much to her. Pika Bell's her name. Uh oh, I might lose you guys. I just said my connection is unsustainable. If I lose you, that'll be the end of the deal. It just blinked on and off. I think I'm still going. Am I still here? You still see me? Huh? Frosty says, lost connection. Let me know if I'm back on. It says I'm live still. Still ticking away, guys. Am I here? Are you there? Okay. All right. Jack R says it's the law in Maryland. You can't do shit there. Why? What's going on in Maryland? Uh, thanks. Thanks, Tim. It blinked off and on for a minute. We got, uh, I'm running off of my cell phone for a Wi-Fi. And, uh, I ain't the only one using, using the cell towers around here. Oh, you guys can see the live chat? Didn't know that. What am I reading it for? Read it yourself. Uh, I didn't know you could read the live chat. That's good. I couldn't. When I broadcast this, it doesn't show it. So maybe it's only there when uh, I'm chatting. You guys can see each other. Uh, anything else you guys want to talk about? Uh, if, if they tell you guys to wear a mask, don't be stubborn. Don't be foolish. Wear your mask. And oh, I was talking about Frosty before I got cut off. His wife, Tinkerbell, is a nurse on the front lines. He has to take her to work every day, and he films going there and coming back. He goes straight out, goes straight back. So don't jump his ass for not staying home. Okay, Charlie, we'll talk to you later. Uh, let's see. Uh, I think that's it, guys. If I hear more, I'll, I'll put it on here. Uh, Frosty, he just said she works in a... A P A R P A R N P clinic. She or she is one. Lots of cases still down there in Florida. That's uh, what's in town where that where she works. I know you live in Ocala, Florida. Uh, now see this. This is real, real. This isn't made up, fake news. Trustee's on the front line. His wife's on the front line. You can believe that there are cases there. We have only got 28 cases here, but that jumped up from three in two weeks. Uh, none out in the, where I'm at in the foothills, mainly I think downtown. Uh, Jack R. Yep, we'll keep the live, live updates coming, guys. I'm going to get off of here. This is long enough. Uh, uh, once again, the River Rally. Red River Rally in Red River, New Mexico is not happening. 
quite a few other ones are not come not happening. Uh, oh, Miami has had around 750 deaths. So, uh, oh, Jack R says about a thousand there. That's not that's not good. Uh, but man, UK, you guys, damn. You guys take care out there, you know, uh, everywhere in the UK, wherever you are, you take care. Uh, I'll do another live stream when I think it's necessary. But. Uh, whoa, did you see what Paul just said? They've lost 20,000 in a state in a country the size of California. This is bad. I, it, when we first started this out, I didn't know if it was real or not. You listen to this crap on the media, and half the people are going, it ain't real, it ain't real, it ain't real. The other half are saying, yeah, it's real. They're, they're dying. Well, here we go. Right there. They're dying. Hi, Randall. Uh, oh, man. Anyway, I didn't want to get on there and talk about the corona. I talked about the rallies and stuff. Uh, Frosty's in Ocala, Florida, Ocala, Florida, where he's at. Uh, that's it. Uh, I'm going to wear masks, but if they tell me I got to get an implant or something, that's, that's a whole other story. I ain't going to be tracked like a robot, and I don't think most of you are either. Y'all stay safe. Hopefully, we all see you at Sturgis. Uh, but you'll see me before then. Uh, ride safe. Stay well. Out of here.